everybody so today I'm doing something different um, this is kind of like an instructional video on adding a, a new core to your uh, analog pocket so alpha mission was released by round monk the third if I'm butchering that I'm sorry it's rndmnk3 uh, he's got a Twitter and a Kofi page which I'll uh, link to but uh, basically it's alpha mission and then two clones which is uh, Aryan mission and um, alpha mission Aryan mission I guess I don't know I guess these are maybe in different regions where they were released as different names. I don't know, but there might be some differences. If you know about that, leave it in the comments. Uh, but let's get right into it. In the instructions, it does say that you need to get this uh, Orca software, and you need to get the Darwin. So this is about using uh, getting this done on a Mac. So you're going to have to get this Darwin, uh, Orca 0.2.0 uh, Darwin. And then the, uh, the ROM recipes, that's his tool chest for actually creating your ROM. So you're going to want to download that as well. Now, this doesn't include the ROMs, and I don't, I'm don't. i not including the ROMs either. You're going to have to source them yourself, and I'll show you the, what they're called and uh, what you're going to be looking for. But uh, it, it does have instructions here on how to do all that. Um, how to, um, it, And again, I'm stressing the fact that the ROM's not included. It's not included on his GitHub. It's not included in this video. And uh, you'll have to supply your own ROMs because what it does, basically the zip file has a bunch of like all the different chips, right? So what this tool does, it's going to compress everything or, you know, combine it into the format that the analog pocket's looking for or what, what you know, this uh, core is looking for, right? So anyways, if you go into your, um, you know, I created a folder called Alpha Mission Stuff and I have all the stuff that I downloaded. So there's that Orca 2.0. There's the uh, the ROM recipes thing. Um, I'm trying to open it up in a new folder or whatever, but you know I couldn't do that. So, anyways, everything that you're gonna need, I put it in one folder. That way, it's just you know a little easier to access all that stuff. Let's go ahead and get past all this. So I'm gonna expand it just so you can see all the different files. So there's the uh, the Alpha Mission Pocket version 1.0. That's the actual core. That's the stuff that you're gonna be adding to your SD card. And this is the ROM recipe. So this is actually the tool chest on how to make your ROMs playable on the pocket and what it's looking for. If you look right above that, I have the three zip files. There's alpha miss.zip, Arian, and uh, Orca. But um, when you, well, Orca, you uh, go ahead and extract that. I'm, I'm going to copy the binary and I'm going to move it into the ROM recipes tools folder. Because if you look in there, there's no Orca, but now there is. I put it there. Okay. And what I have up there is the make ROMs NCV. So that's a, an adjustment that I did, which I'll talk a little bit about. Those are the three ROM files that you're going to need there. Uh, so once you download those, what you're going to have to do is copy those back into the ROM recipes uh, ROMs section. It even has a little thing that says put your ROMs here. So that's where you're going to put it. So once you run the program, what it's going to do, it's, uh, it's, it's looking for those ROMs and it's going to create new assets. Um, and that's the that's the script that I adjusted. Basically, it'll let you uh, run it from anywhere in your on your computer uh, on your Mac. Instead of having, I guess it it's it doesn't really care about the directories as long as it's all like related or in that same area, you know. So so there's the ROMs uh, that it's gonna make. I'm gonna delete them, so we're gonna start from scratch. All right, so they're in. Um, Alpha Mission Assets, Alpha Mission Common, right? So, so now I'm going to open a terminal folder here at that Tools section, or on Tools. If you see above there, it says Tools, so that's where I'm at. And I'm just going to go ahead and list everything that's in there. So it just shows the same files that are up there above, the Make ROMs, the all the different things, the Orca. So now I'm going to run the script, Make ROMs dot or slash underscore NCV enter. It's done. When it's done, you'll get a little message that says processing complete. I always like to know that it's actually finished and it's good. So I went ahead and did that. I exited. And so now if you look into your assets, alpha mission common folder, there are the ROMs that it created. All right. So now we're going to go ahead and put the, um, the actual core into your analog pocket uh, SD card. So what you want to do is just copy all the, the folders that are part of the release which includes assets, cores, platforms, and presets. And you're just going to go ahead and uh, copy all of those over. So that's what I'm doing here. And um, not very creative, but my SD card is called a pocket. So I'm just copying it in there. And then you might get prompted that, you know, you have an existing folder or whatever. Just uh, I apply to all to merge. You don't want to replace. You just want to merge. So just add in the new stuff. 
So once you've got all that done, go back to your tool chest where you made those ROMs, Alpha Mission Common, grab them. So those are the three ROMs that it's looking for. You're going to copy them. Let's go back into the Analog Pocket SD card and let's go into Assets. And then uh, Alpha Mission Common and then drop them in there. You're going to paste those uh, files in there. And you're set. You can exit, uh, get your SD card in and you're good to go. And let's go ahead and check that out. All right, so now that you have your SD card in your analog pocket, you obviously you want to fire it up. So turn it on. Let's get it going. So Alpha Mission, I didn't talk about it earlier. It's, a, it's an SNK game that came out in 1985. Um, and it's not a Neo Geo game. So now we're looking for that core, right? So it's going to be in under Arcade. And I get a little lost there, but it's the first one up there. You saw it right there, ASO, um, because it starts with an A. So it's the first, uh, it's the first core I have now. There it is, ASO Armored Scrum Object. Uh, and I'm pointing it out there because I found it too. So there it is right there, and there's the. Uh, it comes with that, um, I guess, that artwork, the banner, or if you want to call it a marquee, I guess. And uh, we'll go ahead and launch it or get into it. And it is the main game, and then you have a couple of alternatives. And like I was saying, those are the clone games of it. I don't know if there's a difference between the games. Again, mention it in the comics, it, it comments if there, if there are differences, but... I suspect that it's just different regions, different titles. Here's the game actually running. And like I said, it's a cool shooter. And, and uh, this developer, he seems to really like SNK, uh, SNK games. Because uh, some of the other cores that he's done uh, involved it. You know, other games like uh, Athena. And the earlier stuff, uh, uh, SNK Classics is what we'll call them, right? It's before, before Neo Geo. So for those of you that are familiar with Neo Geo, Alpha Mission 2 was their follow-up to this game on the Neo Geo platform. And um, it's all right. It's not bad. It's, it's cool. It definitely has a better sound and all that stuff. But uh, but yeah, it's just a cool game. And this is the very first time that I've actually loaded a, or added a core to my uh, analog pocket. Uh, and I wanted to just kind of figure out how to do it and then uh, share it with you again. If you have a Mac, uh, it might come in handy. I'll, I'll leave a, um, a link to the actual script in the um, in the description. But then I'll also, there'll, there'll also be links... Uh, to the uh, developer's um, GitHub, uh, where you get all this stuff, and then also his Twitter and, and Kofi, if you, your coffee, if you want to, you know, uh, support the developer. But uh, yeah, that's it. Just a quick video on uh, the Analog Pocket and getting things running. Hope you enjoy it. If you have any questions, leave it in the comments. Uh, otherwise, until next time.